I am going to watch three cinematics of Dawn of War. Yeah, I was thinking of checking out Dawn of War one or two, but people are saying they're totally different. Like the first one is a RTS RTS and the second one has actually some RPG elements and uh, none of the base building like the first one does. So this is going to be the very first Dawn of War cinematic. I think this is from, oh no, it's not even 2006, hold on, it's 2000, it says 2004, 2004, that's when Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines came out. Yeah, that does look like war, that never changes. Okay, I see some orcs. Such an action packed trailer. Uh, sorry. F for an RTS. They might love it. It looks cool. Put that flag! Put that flag! No! Wow. Wow. For the Emperor, you guys. For the Emperor. I can see myself watching this in like 2004 and be like, Oh, that's so cool. I want to play it. <laughs> yeah, the sounds are blown out. The sounds are so distorted. <laughs> Okay, that was very loud. That was very like 2004. I love it. I love it. Lots of action. Uh, I, I, I wonder what, what the game itself is like. So, um, so what are the vanilla uh, factions that the that that are fighting? Obviously, aside from the ones shown in the trailer. All right. So this is a DLC, Dark Crusade. Yeah, for the first game. Yeah, I see a Necron there. Oh my God, the noise. Well, I guess they didn't win. <laughs> like, oh my god, the, like the noise, the distortion, the uh, everything <laughs> makes my brain... <laughs> they actually won that DLC, it makes my brain hurt. But maybe later, uh, Dawn of War uh, games actually look like these trailers. Dawn of War Soulstorm trailer. I hope it's not going to be as loud as the other ones. <laughs> huh? It's so blurry. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I would love to make it a better quality. <laughs> This is cute. <laughs> oh my god, that blood splatter. <laughs> oh, oh my god, sisters! Sisters! Guys, this is your waifus. Oh damn! Okay. <laughs> okay, that was cute. Like, come on. For the greater good. Uh, all right, let's let's watch Dawn of War two now. All right, two thousand and nine. Better, 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 much better. Two thousand and nine. It's like what Dragon Age Origins was released on two thousand and nine. So like this has to look way way better, especially a cinematic. Oh, see, so Chris. Way more crisp. Let's go. It's gonna be the Ultramarines. Oh. This planet will be ours. You lost this war before you started. The old Damn, that's savage. Through the armor. How the hell did they do this? Oh no, these ain't ultramarines. Oh wait, I can't tell that color. No. That's blood angels. Okay, this looks way better. This is so cool. This is some rogue assassin shit. <laughs> Set that wig on fire. <laughs> I thought he was done for. This planet is ours, witch. No. Witch. This planet is theirs. Tyranids. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, what is this? Oh my god, it's a swarm of Tyranids. Getting goosebumps. Okay. This was actually good. This actually gave me goosebumps. Okay. That's how you know it's good. Yeah, I I thought they were they were ultramarines because they, they their armor kind of looked uh, bluish in that lighting. Um, yes, yeah, so, but th th then I was like, no, 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 it can't be ultramarines. The first uh, the first Dawn of War cinematics looked kind of funny. All right, this looked serious. This looked realistic, serious, top tier, like like a trailer should look, like a proper trailer. So Blood Ravens is the chapter of Blood Angels. Mm -hmm. Alright, Chaos Rising. This is a DLC for Dawn of War 2. The 
full might of chaos is arrayed against you, Blood Ravens. You cannot escape me. You belong to me. Lots of heresy in this one. Your only path to victory is to join us, brothers. Okay, so it's gonna be the, the, the space wolves, right? I think so. Chaos Rising. Oh, okay, this is cool. There was Nurgle in there. There's a bunch of stuff. Okay, okay. Well, like it's short and it mostly showed uh, the gameplay, not the you know not the cinematic or anything. Oh, all right. This one is nice quality. I am Gabriel Angelos, captain of the Blood Ravens. My chapter is in ruins. The sector is at war. <laughs> It's worlds under siege. Chaos spreads, consumes us all. Here, this is a we will one. make our final stand. What the hell is this? Here, this is a corn. Retribution. This is a corn, corn spawn or something. I don't even know. All right, this one, this one actually looked good. A demon prince. He said the word. Okay, I like this one. <laughs> okay, let's watch the exterminators. Okay. We have arrived, and it is now that we perform our charge. Uh oh. They're going to. In fealty of the God Emperor. Our undying lord, and by the grace of the Golden Throne, I declare exterminatus upon the Imperial world of Typhon Primaris. Such I a beautiful planet. I sign the death warrant of an entire world, and consign a million souls to oblivion. <laughs> May Imperial justice account in all balance. The Emperor protects. That's justice to you. Bye bye, world. It is human nature to seek culpability in a time of tragedy. It is a sign of strength to cry out against fate rather than to bow one's head and succumb. Inevitably, many shall fault the hands upon the sword which felled Typhon, the Ordo Malleus. But the Inquisition merely performs the duty of its office. To further fear them is redundant. To hate them, heretical. Those more sensible will place responsibility going to launch with that those thing? who forced the hands of the Inquisition. With some fortune, they may foster this hatred into purpose and further rule their own fate by coming to the Emperor's service. Yet ultimately, it was I who set these events into motion with a single blow from my hammer, God Splitter. Oh shit. Oh, such a tiny thing can blow up the whole planet. That was cool. Didn't give me goosebumps, but you know, it was everybody's saying exterminators, 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 but I've never seen it, you know, the process of it. So like, at least I have a, I have a vision now, a clear vision. Yes, innocence proves nothing. I learned that. That was like the first thing I learned about Warhammer. <laughs> People taught me. <laughs> then the third one, right? We're going to watch it and decide. No, the cinematic might have been good, but the, the game itself was, uh, was was shite. So even though get the game failed terribly, the, the trailer is still going to stay in our hearts. Look at this. Look at this beautiful burnt, burnt, burnt man. He deserves some love, okay, and some recognition. Why was it bad, you guys? What was so bad about it? 
There's a terrible darkness descending upon the galaxy, and we shall. No, I need to. I need to know. Sorry, and we shall not see it ended. In our lifetimes, Inquisitor Sevak. Okay, that's some you know realistic view of the things. Okay, this looks cool. In darkness, I shall be light. Oh, he's alive. Oh, this wasn't the one who got dropped down. In times of doubt. This kind of looks like a start is. I shall keep faith. What is this? In vengeance, I shall have no mercy. These look so cool. The orc mechas. Smiling. He died smiling. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Okay. That's what I call a badass trailer. I still have goosebumps all over my uh, legs, like going down nonstop. <laughs> then the game happened. <laughs> Damn, I'm sorry for all of you who got debated by this wonderful, beautiful, gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous piece of cinematography. Oh, it was in 2017. Okay. Are they, they're not going to continue the Dawn of War series anymore? So, okay, okay, gotcha. Don't play Dawn of War 3. Play 1 if you like it. Keep playing it. If you don't like it, try 2. I think if it's gonna be Dawn of War, I think I'm going to start off stream first, not to be like too um, anxious and like because starting an, a new game, especially an RTS on stream that is completely unfamiliar to me, might be stressful. So I like I might try it off stream, and if I feel okay playing it, then yeah, I could play it on stream. So join the Discord, uh, check out the YouTube for all the other reactions. Bye bye bye. Appreciate y'all. Thank you so much for watching and a special thanks to the members of our channel for their support. Thank you so much.